The Root Cellar is a 100% local food store. Everything in the store comes from Kentucky and Southern Indiana farmers. We buy direct from local farmers and we sell to the Louisville community. We're open seven days a week. The idea behind the Root Cellar is to provide fresh, local, high quality food to Louisvillians and to support the local farmers in the process. The local agrarian economy is very important and we really need to focus on that. People want fresh local food and we, we're striving to provide them with that. Our first store is uh, the one I opened two and a half years ago. is right here in Old Louisville at the corner of 3rd and Hill in a historic gas station. And we also have a location in Germantown at the corner of Swan in Kentucky. The Root Cellar was started out of necessity. I lost my job in March of 2010 and I needed a way to support myself and my family. So having um, a real attraction to local food, I've always been uh, uh, a visitor to farmers markets, I've always cooked local food and befriended many of the local farmers, I decided that there was a missing need here, an unmet need. Uh, if I could open a retail store and sell this type of food direct from the farms to Louisvillians, then maybe, maybe it would fulfill some of that, that demand. We do uh, the whole range of anything local. Um, and it's all sourced locally. I visit all of the farms. We visit all of the farmers. We know the farmers, their husbands or wives, their children. I even know, the, you know, we know their dogs' names. These are, this is part of the family, you know. By having those, fam those farm families be important to us, they become important to the community. We have honey and maple syrup and sorghum. We go to Midway, Kentucky, uh, Mac and Phillip grind in the old Weisenberger mill. They grind all their flour and corn products. We carry all of their products. We carry uh, uh, the whole range of fruits and vegetables. Berries, peaches, apples, pears. We have watermelon and cantaloupe in season. Corn, squash, sweet potatoes. We have eight different varieties of, of Irish type potatoes, mealy and waxy, purple and blue. We carry nine different species of farm animal and we carry literally tongue to tail. So we have beef, pork, bison, turkey, chicken, duck, guinea hen, and rabbit on occasion. These are all sourced locally from local farmers. They're processed in USDA inspected facilities, all local meat processing facilities. The variety of food that's out there that's available is amazing. One of the missions of the store is to actually provide access to local foods to neighborhoods that may not have those. And the predominant uh, food deserts, as they're called, are on the west and south ends of Louisville. So I started to think about the mission and I, I started to think about the desire to go into West Louisville neighborhoods. And my idea to have the root mobile came out of that. It's gonna hum on veg oil and we're gonna be delivering fresh fruits and vegetables all over town. The root mobile is our attempt to bring healthy local food to some of the people who need it the most. We go to these neighborhoods and we have a set schedule and people get used to it. It's like a weekly farmer's market without actually having to set up a farmer's market. We actually funded part of this project through a, a Kickstarter program, crowdsourcing or crowdfunding as it's called. Kickstarter is just the website that enables that. You believe in what the root sellers do, then we ask that not only you donate, but please get your friends and your families to donate. I was very clear in saying this is a tool that I would like the community to be involved in. And so it's a cumulative thing. And I think that people that supported the Kickstarter recognize that. So now we're just doing the hard work of putting it on the bus, getting the food out there, and believe me, it's hard work. The Roommobile is a TARC 3 bus that we've converted into a mobile food store. All of the seats have been removed and the wheelchair lift in the back have been taken out and we put in a staircase and 
a refrigerator and a freezer and we have countertops and a checkout counter with the computer cash register and scale. So it's basically a food truck that I can pull up on the corner, sell my wares for three or four hours like a rolling farmer's market and then head off to the next neighborhood the next day. We're so fortunate to have the wonderful farmers and, and farms and the wonderful products that they, that they grow, and we're happy to be a part of that. We just hope it continues to grow, they continue to have success, more people become interested in farming, in local food, in eating better, and hopefully you'll be enjoying some of the fresh local produce that the farms in Kentucky and Southern Indiana have to offer.